Well, hi everybody. I thought I'd uh, show you guys what I'm up to. Today was a, a very exciting race and probably one of my best uh, performances. So I thought I'd show a little clip of, uh, of it. And uh, what you're going to listen to here, what you're listening to here is uh, yeah. uh, uh, a nice comment from Chris there. Andy will be broadcast the of our races. Tonight. Every race is broadcast. <laughs> so I'll let, I'll let uh, the broadcasters, yeah. the professional the Lesky, broadcasters you know, tell us. Lesky's managed to take what it's about Andreas. and I'll show you something afterwards. No, we didn't see that coming, did we? So Maleski's now on the back of... Um, yes, he is. So I don't know if Andreas made a mistake there. I mean, Andreas was a bit concerned. He messaged me before. He said, I don't want to take anybody out. So maybe what it's done is he's seen Mike coming at, coming at Willie and he's thought, I'm going to let him go. And rather than get in the way, um, you know, he's, he's, le he's letting go there. So I think he's letting Mike chase Willie down. Uh, Andy Goddard's now managing to put in a quick lap. That was bullshit because uh, Andreas passed me later. I think he's one of the on the <laughs> just track wanted the to say that. <laughs> but we'll see where that takes him. He was gaining at one point, but he lost a couple of seconds to. Uh, yeah, he he looks like he's just he just looks like he's starting to pull it back again. You know, the time's coming down. It would be good to see something. Yeah. Towards the end, if you can push, now is the time to do it. It is indeed. This, this is where the action is at the moment, these three cars. And also, I would say the last 10 minutes is where, you know, if you're tired or anything, uh, you can be leading the race and, and throw it in the sand, you know, you anything can. can happen. Yeah. You can that see there, pathetic. Andreas could have carried Watch on what happens next. off a little bit. So I think Andre, Andreas is called the uh, announcer's curse. the other drivers because he knows he's not gaining points. Well, Goddard actually—he's he's he's caught, caught him up. Yeah, he, yeah. yeah, I said yeah. I said he was one of the fastest on track. Yeah. So either that or Billy's got a problem with his tyres, and as a result of that, it means he's got nine nine minutes. Oh, Willie's gone off. Has he outbroke himself. Oh, too bad. No, he's managed to keep it going. It all depends on whether Mike's yes. got a good run. Can he get him up the inside? Wouldn't take it there, but it will mean that Mike's going to get a good run on the start finish straight. That's ambitious. It's very ambitious. <laughs> yeah, but see, yeah, but see, they're giving each other space. Yeah, that's yeah. very nice to see. That's very it nice is. to see. That is very good racing. I actually thought Maleski was going to um, spin on the curb because it can pull the f uh, front end of the car around. But these are still at it. Hi, Krista. Welcome to the stream. That's Been really a... good racing there. <laughs> Look how clean that is. The side by side. <laughs> very nice. Very nice. That's how it's done, isn't it? That is how it's oh, done. Yeah. Absolutely oh, yeah. brilliant. Really nice. I mean, really, that's a pleasure to watch. That's what it's all about. God, that's insane. <laughs> They're still at it. They still that's at pretty good. It. <laughs> oh, that was awesome. I can imagine the adrenaline pumping then with the pair of them. Wow, that's awesome. But see, that that's good. You you mm. give each other space and and the fun starts. Yeah, it doesn't doesn't have to be contact, does there? <laughs> no contact whatsoever and and very close racing at the same time, so it can be done. It and can. when you see the you can when you see that it can be done. Yeah. And these guys, you you have four racers and here here you have Christopher trying to do the inside and he's, he's yeah he's he done is. it he's managed to do it yeah wow so that's I'm just, two cars at once I'm just wondering whether when Willie went off before he's, he's got problems with his tyres a little bit so that was pretty exciting now I'm going to show it to you uh, same part of it from my perspective inside the car so this is a real time or a recording kind of thing of, of what it looked like from my perspective when I was racing a lot more exciting uh, let's see if I can get it going here. Go. Now, I've been following Willie for like 15, 20 minutes, so I know exactly where he's faster or when I'm faster. So you got to follow the guy until uh, you think he's going to make a mistake. And uh, he does end up making a, a mistake at some point. But you'll notice uh, it's so hard not to follow a guy into the off the track when he goes off the track, and which is almost what I do. But somehow I uh, hold held it together coming up here so this kind of racing up close was going on for a long time 20 minutes Willie uh, who's the guy in orange there is 
pretty good also. So here's where he loses it a bit. And I almost follow him in for a second. And then somehow I managed to keep it going. We both hang in there. But I got a little bit of momentum on him here. And I thought about passing him right here, but I laid off a little bit. But I'm getting anxious. I'm saying, I gotta, I gotta get this done. I don't know where he caught some traction and I didn't. Right there, maybe the curb. My wheels spun in the curb, possibly. But I'm, I'm, uh, I'm gonna get it done here. I thought I had him right here. I passed him, and then somehow he keeps it going. See him out of my corner of my eye. He's still there. Now there's a, there's a uh, piece of software that talks to you when you're racing like this, and it says, "There's a guy beside you." He says, "Right side, still there." still there and he's saying this all the way along still there still there now look at this we're racing out full speed here 200 kilometers an hour side by side still this is where I almost blow it and there it is I passed him I'm trying to hang on now at this point he's probably pissed and he's trying to try and take me again in a second but uh, I'm a little bit quicker on this corner usually so and that's it that was my excitement today and I can tell you, I was, uh, by the if, if at the end of this race, it kept going just like this. At the end of this race, I was sweating. Colleen said, uh, geez, what are you sweating so much for? I said, well, you should have seen what I did. Anyway, that's my excitement for today. See you guys. Thanks for watching.